Hello everyone, my name is Carly Nimmer and I am a first generation college student and I'm so proud to, to be here. I, my background is in marketing as well as journalism and I'm also the founder of Pencils with a Purpose, a community organization which focuses on giving back to families, schools, and churches in, um, in school supplies and in funding. So the reason why we're all here today is to answer the prompt we were given. How can you help help uh, young people, especially students, save money? And with that, I have the perfect and appropriate answer, and that is called Student Saver. And what we're doing at Student Saver is we are today's students building a promising tomorrow, okay? So first of all, we have to realize before we can jump into Student Saver that America has a tremendous problem on their hands. And that is that millennials are taking charge of managing money, which is excellent. In my research, I found out that millennials are actually taking on more financial responsibility of themselves. So they're actually managing their own finances more than ever. But the financial responsibility is plummeting. If you look at this chart in this independent study by usnews.com, you'll see that the trends of paying their credit bills on time, <coughs> excuse me, and even just reviewing their bills has gone down tremendously since 2012. Also, 62% of students check their account balances, which means roughly 30% of students are not even looking at their balances on a regular basis. That's a huge problem, ladies and gentlemen. That means that 30% of student credit card bills and finances are not being attended to, and they are not getting paid on time, which means um, more debt for them in the future. Also, one more thing to point out is that only 17 states in the United States require a four-year college um, to, to um, they require their students to take an actual financial planning and financial learning education class. So that's only 17 states. However, America does have a solution, and that is Student Saver. So basically what it is, it's a two-fold system. You earn recognition for smart financial choices in the short term. And as millennials, we love to be rewarded. We love to, to be shown um, some type of award. And secondly, we build habits to be financially responsible in the future so that we can carry out these habits throughout the rest of our life. And once again, we can do that with Student Saver. So what is Student Saver, you might ask? It is a mobile application that is usable on Apple or Android devices. It combines all financial accounts into one seamlessly integrated dashboard. So whether it's checking accounts, saving accounts, money market, stock market, it's all listed right on our app, Student Saver. Students create long-term and short-term goals by putting in their, their, um, their habits, their habitual buying, buying procedures, um, what they're interested in, where they're located, what their income is, and then users earn badges for every goal that they complete. That's that reward kickback that they're getting. And also, it eliminates the problem of students not checking into accounts regularly. Because as I mentioned earlier, only 63% of students are doing that on a regular basis. This eliminates that problem because all of their accounts are in one place that they can look at. Now, you may be wondering, Candy Crush Saga and Fitbits. What the heck does this have to do with Student Saver and CUNA Mutual? Well, let's take a look at this. So Candy Crush Saga, it's, if you've never played it before, if you've never heard of it, it's a game that is found on Facebook or its very own app. And ladies and gentlemen, it is extremely addicting. And that's because they give you rewards, but they also hold you back at times. So there is a bit of a, a need and a want to continue to play this game. The same thing can be said for Fitbits. My boyfriend, let's take for example, if he doesn't meet his Fitbit goal for the day, he stands in front of the TV and he marches until he gets those, those 12,000 steps. Does anybody know someone like that? Yes? It's very <laughs> addicting. And uh, as you can see, I'm wearing my Fitbit myself. Ted Cruz is also proud to wear his Fitbit at uh, presidential campaigns and debate. So um, it's, they're both an extremely successful brand. Um, Fitbit actually has 20 million users since 2012 and it, devices that have been sold. Um, over 60 billion people play Candy Crush. 
They're both extremely successful, and we've seen the success that these two brands have had in their rewards that they give to their users. So the analysis of Candy Crush and Fitbit, I'll walk through this just a little bit. There is anticipation. You can't actually lose, like I mentioned. It's social. It keeps you connected with friends, both of them do, on their apps. It grows on you. It rewards its users with the badges, and it's very simple to understand for both of them. So here is a setup of our, of our application, Student Saver. So first, I'm going to direct your attention right here to the bottom. We have the home page, which we are on right now. You have the options to go to your accounts, which shows you all of your accounts that I mentioned earlier. We also have settings where you set your spending habits and information. You have the badges right down here, which is where all of the badges you've earned, you can look at them and see which ones you still have to gain. And then we have a couple more options in terms of inviting friends um, and seeing who your friends are on the application. Now up here, you see you have a Visa credit card statement, which is due tomorrow. So it gives you those notica notifications when your statements are due. So um, you won't have any late statements. It tells you when new friends join and what recent badges you have earned. And then it also gives you investing and saving tips of the day and of the week in our quick links right here. And when someone earns a badge, it'll pop right up on that screen and give you immediate satisfaction, which we as millennials strive for. So our summary today, we talked about millennials and how they're making poor financial decisions and not even looking at their financial statements at times. We talked about the twofold system of student saver that mitigates this problem that we've been talking about for the last eight minutes. We've also talked about how student saver streamlines personal finances and has them all in one place at the same time. We've also talked about the collaboration of the advantages and the successes that we've seen with apps like Fitbit and Candy Crush. And it is also the very first app of its kind to promote financial growth, streamline all the accounts, and keep attention with a game-like presence. The very first one to do that. I agree, Mint.com is a great app, but you do not have a game-like presence. What I would also like to mention, I come from a small business family. And my mom, the owner, has always said to me, Carly, a loss is a loss, and a gain is a gain, no matter how small. And I agree. And with Student Saver, we can help make those gains and mitigate those losses by using this application. Thank you. Questions? Yes. How do you promote it? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, social media is huge, definitely. So, like I mentioned, we want to get it socially, so you're able to, to work with your friends. So socially is huge. Also with CUNA Mutual, what I would like to see is that it becomes like a sister program to it. So this is a great step for college students. Remember, we're targeting college students here. They love games. They love the reward aspect of it. So if CUNA Mutual takes this application under their wing and they use it as a stepping stone to get to the next financial actual planning stage of it. Because right now, we're just trying to get college students to save and learn about investing. I know that my problem, and for many college students out there, is that everything is so intimidating when it comes to investing and saving. And this is a great way to start that. So the connection with Kuna Mutual is, is the sponsorship of the app? Correct. Okay. Any other questions, please? One other thing that I would like to note is that I would like the app to see <clears throat> a 168-bit um, encryption rate also, which is the highest security of its kind. And that means that all of the financial, uh, financial records and, um, and I guess accounts would all be very secure. Yes? Um, I think I might have missed this part. What would you be, like if you were connected with friends, mm -hmm. what is it that you would be, uh, what's the game that you would be playing against? Them? Right. So you get to compete against each other. So let's say for, for me personally, I know, I like to get a latte every morning. If I cut back on my latte intake and I get a badge for that, then my friend would also say, oh man, you know, Carly, Carly you know, got her badge for that. I also want to, to reduce my intake of something that I actually don't need and save money by doing that. And like I said, we have seen the success with Candy Crush and Fitbit and um, it would definitely be useful with Student Saver as well. Thank you. Thank you.